Hi everyone! So this video is a little different than the ones I've been making so far because it is a travel video but it's combined with a makeup tutorial. So I'm kind of going to show you a flashback of my weekend and then I'm going to show you the look that I created inspired by the weekend and why I was inspired by the weekend. So this is it right here, the look that I came up with and if you watch the recap of my weekend then you will see why. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hi everyone, so right now I am in Italy, but that's Switzerland. It's so weird to me, I can't like grasp the concept. So this is a lake that divides Italy and Switzerland, but this is like the Switzerland lake. And then there's the Italian lake called... Maggiore. Lago Maggiore, which is where we're going after this. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna walk around and explore the north of Italy some more. So now I'm in this tiny little town called Arcumeja, which is where my uncles live, and I love it. I feel like it's straight out of the storybook. You could just walk around, all the streets are made of pebbles, and this is their dog, and I started to go for a walk. What's unique and cool about this little town is that on the houses, you have like fresco paintings on them. So I will walk this way and show you a few. This one, it looks like a woman peeking out through a window. So, and this one is a painting of people biking. So what's very common of this town is that people use these streets to train for biking races, marathons, cycling. I don't know the words, but just come this way and I'll show you a little more about this town. Would it be a marathon? Marathon's for running, isn't it? Yes. Or does it count for run for bike? Biking? I think. A triathlon is running bike. I sound so stupid. <laughs> Honestly. Oh, I like that wall. It's like all painted. We found a blackberry tree and I kind of want to taste one. Church, church camp. I hope I don't die. Oh my god, they're actually so good. I need one of these. Wait, what did you just say to me? You completed your vegan fantasy. It's very true, I did. I want to take this tree home. Now we are in Lavello and this is Lago Maggiore. We're on, this is like the Italian lake. It looks like there's a castle. <laughs> it looks so beautiful and so peaceful here. So now we're at this beach called Spiaggia Cate and the water is so freaking <laughs> but I'm determined to go in. It's like freezing, like my feet are too. Try to come up. Wow. My bones are frozen, like my feet are frozen. Lake, it's not the ocean, so the water's 
scratch, but it's not. Like my bones hurt, but I have to do it for the experience. So now we are in Lino and we just came here to watch the sunset. It's been such a long day but we've done so much, it's been so fun. Um, and it's like no matter where you go, the landscape is still beautiful. Like you have this beautiful landscape and this beautiful view. It's truly amazing and I'm so impressed. I wasn't expecting this at all. But I loved it and I'm planning on creating a look based on maybe the yellows that I wore today or just the lake that I went into because it was honestly breathtaking. So I'm going to start by taking the Jaclyn Hill palette and I'm using the shade Creamsicle which is this yellow orange right here. So I did my, okay, I should start there. I did my foundation, my brows, my bronzer, my blush, and my highlight off camera. I also primed my eyes and I did my right eye so that this wouldn't take super long and it would be a quick tutorial. So I'm going to start with that yellow, that creamsicle, and I'm going to put it all over the crease. And we're just going to build this color up. You don't want to start too strong. I'm sorry if my lower lash line on this eye looks a little whack. I had an incident and I, my eye was crying. I had to like fix it. It was a mission, but. Now I'm gonna go in with the Naked 3 palette brush, the fluffy end. And I'm gonna take buns, I believe. Yes, buns which is this shade right here. I'm just going to take it on the end of that brush and I'm going to put this on the outer and inner corners. Now into the real stuff. I'm going to take a flat fluffy brush and I'm going to go into not Diva, Enchanted. I'm going to take that on the end of that fluffy brush just a little bit and then again I'm gonna put this in my inner and outer corners and lightly go over the center very lightly though Okay, now that that is done, I'm going to take the chocolate bar palette and I'm going to go into Gilded Ganache. Dude, my eyes still crying. I hurt myself. Okay, I'm going to go into Gilded Ganache, which is this shade right here, which broke when I dropped it, but luckily there's still a little bit left. And for this look, a little bit is all we need. So... I'm going to take MAC Fix Plus and I'm going to spray that and then I'm going to put it right down the center of the lid where there's nothing. I'm actually, I, was I covering you? I'm sorry, all I did was literally this and then I'm going to retouch this side. Because it's looking a little whack. Okay, and now I'm going to go into that darker green, the matte green, which is Enchanted. And again, I'm going to re-emphasize the inner and outer corners of the eye. For the lower lid, I'm going to go in with that fluffy brush and whatever product is left of that green, I'm just going to smudge it on my lower lash line. And then I'm going to go in with the fluffy brush with, that has leftover creamsicle on it. 
And I'm gonna blend that out. There was not enough creamsicle, so I added some more. I know this is a giant brush for the lower lash line, but it already has the product that we need on it. And I don't wanna re-add any product because then the color will be too strong. So I'm just using it. Now we go in with mascara. Okay, before we put mascara on the lower lash line, I'm just gonna take my Kiko Milano highlighter pencil and go over that lower lash line. Now I can put mascara on my lower lash line. Now, I'm gonna get my highlighter to highlight my inner corner. Hold on. Okay, I'm using ColourPop's Whisk Color Pops. Super Shock Shadow in the shade Whisk. No, Super Shock Cheek Our Shadow. So that I'm extra shiny. And then for my lips, I think I'm gonna do a gloss since the eyes are pretty matte. And I'm gonna go in with Hot Toy. But first, I'm gonna use Max Honey Love. So that is it for this video. This is the finished look. I hope you're enjoying these series of travel videos um, because I know that I'm loving making them. I'm having a great time and I'm loving sharing it with all of you. So stay tuned for my next adventure and just subscribe to our channel and click the bell so that you get notifications the next time I post a video. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching. Bye. Está en focus. Mm -hmm. Está grabando. No se ve el rostro. No, ¿cómo es que se graba? Está la lucecita roja, Ajá, okay. pero no palpita. No. A ver, um, póker, póker. Doesn't pay attention to me now. Póker, seduto, seduto.